folks, we are back. Oh, I gotta make sure my game is actually recording properly. <clears throat> folks, we're back. Are we streaming? We are. Wow. Now, last we played, we got out of the morgue. And Tara was having some bad internet issues that night. Yeah, but it's fixed now. Oh, that's right. Okay, so we got... S so... Little Nightmare Tara got sucked into the poop dimension. Um, oh, yeah, I got so fucked. Yeah. Okay. So, I don't know if I'm, like, even alive or what. She got sucked by... By Slender TV. Yeah. Tara, want to hear an aut another autistic thing about me? Every time I roll shopping carts, I know there's so many already, but every time I roll shopping carts, I struggle so much with the wheels. It's kind of embarrassing. Well, like, some shopping carts just have really shitty wheels. I feel like either most of them I have do, but I always look like a fucking idiot. <laughs> That's why you gotta pick the ones with the good wheels. Okay, I gotta be careful because the water here is electrified. Oh. Okay. It's a little bedroom. You like the sound of the pitter patter of the rain on the window? <laughs> you know, I would have been in Florida this week if, uh, if, if if things weren't already effing crazy enough, I would have been in Florida this week at our, at Marco Island. You know there's a hurricane coming. I know. Oh shit! We better I was like, better wish my coworker. Yeah. It's really it's not gonna be bad. It's gonna be a tropy stormy, right? Yeah. Most likely. But I, yeah, I would have been in Marco Island. Isn't that kind of crazy? Oh, I know what I gotta do. I'm being silly. But I had to say no. I think I, I do think I disappointed my boss with that. But it's like literally. I mean, this month is effing crazy enough as it is. Okay. <laughs> Also, it would have lasted into Sunday, which literally just would not have worked. Because I still gotta watch my little dog. Terry, you're gonna love Louie. Well, I hope so. But, he's gonna love- I hope he's not afraid of me. He's not gonna be afraid of you. He's gonna bark at you at first, but I have a feeling he's gonna fall in love with you very quickly. Aww. You're gonna be his like. You're gonna be like his like. What what do you call it? Pseudo mom. Uh, what's it called when you're not like the mother? Surrogate. Surrogate. Yeah, you're gonna be a surrogate mom. Does he like females? He does. Well, we'll just be pals then. He's gonna wanna lay with you. Not even joking. That's okay. I wish Allie would lay with me. Oh my god, what am I doing here? <laughs> I don't- I don't know. <laughs> I, I actually really don't know what I'm doing here. I, I figured that I had to- Oh, okay, I have to turn the electricity back on now? But- but how? 
Oh, I guess I could just come back over here again. Okay. I get it now. <laughs> okay, I might have bad depth perception. Got so many levers everywhere, you know? Yeah. Except with all the levers on. Oh my god. Careful. What do I have in my hand? Throw that. Throw that away. Oh. oh Please. Spare me. Is the shopping cart at least back in the right place? Oh, that ball just appeared. It's not. <laughs> Whoa, it disappeared again. <laughs> We've been having issues with disappearing balls recently. Like in Zelda. <laughs> Remember? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that one was a giant ball. Yeah. That was a pretty big issue. Me and Tara and Taylor watched Night at the Museum. Tara fell asleep, but she's already seen it. So did Many I. times. Many times. I think I've only seen the sequel once. Um, I think I've only seen the sequel once as well. I'm trying to get it to turn. I remember Rami Malik has like a bigger, a bigger role in that one. Okay, let's see if I can make that jump before I do it. I know, like, Amy Adams was in it. She was Amelia Earhart. And don't, like, Ben Stiller and Amelia Earhart have, like, a little romance thing going on? I I kept suspecting that would... I kept suspecting that would happen with... With the... What's it called? The girl from the front desk at the... The Natural History Museum. Where she clearly didn't come back, so... Yeah, I know. It's weird. <laughs> sequel. Oh my f She was filming, um, Gerald's game. <laughs> really? Is that the one? Is that the one where she gets caught in the woods or something? No, she gets, like, chained up to a bed. Yeah, in the woods. Well, well, it's in, like, a cabin. I've no- I have not seen it. I've only heard about the movie. Yeah, same here. I watched the other movie that that guy made, uh, Hush, last night with my friends. Mm-hmm. I like Hush. Hush is a great film. Hush is like a genuinely good film. Big recommendation for anyone. And I've seen it before, so the fact that I still like it on second watch, I think. Goes to show is it definitely Is that the out. ones where the kids have to stay quiet? No, that's that's Don't Breathe. Don't Breathe. That's a good movie too. Don't Breathe was like shockingly good, in my opinion. But Hush was also shockingly good. Actually, it's not, I wouldn't call it sh Shockingly good, I would say. Oh, Tara. Get it? <laughs> oh my goodness. Bros, I'm failing tonight. My gamer senses are off. Um. But yeah. Recommend Hush. Hush is a movie. It's the woman who is, um, who is deaf and mute. And she's <laughs> being stalked by some creep in the woods. Did you see that one? No. Really? That's a good film. You would really like it. 
It's, it's like, I, I wouldn't even really call it a scary film. It's just a, it's a good thriller. It's a good thriller. Don't Breathe, also a good thriller. Have you seen Don't Breathe, at least? I think so. But that chick who kind of looked like uh, Emma Stone. Can't remember who's in it. I think it's a bunch of like kind of no names, which is cool. Hey, filmmakers, can we get more movies that aren't filled with like the same fucking five people? Yeah, I I actually really like shows that I've never seen acted before. Nope. <laughs> Damn it. Sorry. Yeah, I I appreciate that in films. That's like a that's like a big like plus for me. And then they made Don't Breathe too. <laughs> wow. All right. Whew. We did it this time. We're now going the TV. Don't fall. Finally. <laughs> I was worried you were gonna fall. I was too. What am I? Where? Where am I? Where's Tara? Uh -huh. I'm in the TV somewhere. She's in the TV world. Oh God. Oh my. They're distracted. It's all good. I need like a brick to throw through that window. Is that a window? Yeah. Oh god. Oh lord. Oh, oh lord. lord, what have I done? Oh yeah. What she... are you supposed to do? I'm not sure. I feel like I I, I need something. Oh, I, I guess I I need them to like step away from the TV. And make them watch that TV in the window. Oh. Shit, I couldn't turn that on last time. I didn't think I could turn it on. Yeah. This is just a running sequence. You just run. You just run, okay? Ooh, they like the TV. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, God! Oh, you can go in there. I told your brother. He messaged me back. Just want to see what your bro said. I told him about our plan. He said, no, nice, I will join you. Do I have to pay you manually? He could pay you and then you could pay me. I don't know if you want that. I would rather him to pay you. Okay. Oh god, I... <laughs> I couldn't clawing fast enough. I couldn't clawing fast enough. 
Run, you little tiny thing! Run, you little fucking nightmare! Oh, I need to kill you faster! I need to- I need to run! You got it, you got it. You're way ahead of me. Oh my god. Well, that was <laughs> so scary. Why do these people want to watch TV so bad? I don't know, man. <gasps> Tara! Hey! Get me out! Get me out! Shit. Fucker. Oh fucking Christ! What? I'm fucking taking it down! What the fuck was I supposed to do there? I don't know. Maybe you're supposed to get captured. Oh, maybe I have to, like, destroy the TV? Oh... Why does he want me so bad? He, he knows that you're a little nightmare. Maybe you use the axe to break through the door. Oh, exactly yeah. The door. I don't want to fucking do it! There, is it too heavy? I forgot the button to do it. Ah. Uh. <laughs> damn it. God fucking damn. Folks, I've been failing all night. Little man, oh. Can you hear me okay, by the way? When it gets loud, it's a little bit. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry, don't worry. The game doesn't get that loud that often. Where'd the fucking axe go now? Well, okay, it glitched up, so I'm literally fucked. Well, that's not very fair. It actually glitched up that time. Let's hope it doesn't glitch up again. What happened? The axe didn't fall. Oh, okay. This game... Or maybe it didn't, I just can't fucking see it because this game is so damn dark. Where'd the fucking axe fall? Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, I think, I, I gotta be honest, I think the game's a little glitched up right now. Like, I think I need to, I, I think I need to restart on this. Okay. Because there are some things I think that are just either not appearing, like that ball that we saw earlier. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna exit the desktop. We're gonna just restart it, folks. Stand by, stand by. Sorry, if I just knew it the first time, you would have had it. Band Konamkai.
super massive. Referring to my cock. I'm sorry. Was that necessary? Sorry. I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> okay, we could we could actually see the axe up on the wall now, so that's oh, good. that's a good start. <laughs> This is a freaky nightmare. I have to deal with this over and over again, man. I know, that is a nightmare. Why you do this to me? This is like my stress dreams. There it is. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Good luck fitting in here, tall man. Yeah, you're too tall to fit here. Oh god, he's above me. Such a little nightmare. Oh, oh dear lord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm such a fucking little nightmare. I've got to go. He's going faster than me. Yeah, he's going fast. Shit. He's going fast this time. Pull the thing off. Go! <laughs> no! Oh, okay, that's okay. Oh my god. Come on, bro. Oof. Oh, 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 uh, this is like uncharted. Okay, my house cam's going a little wild right now. Oh, really? Really, guy? Come on. He's so fucking fast, I need to run. Get a life bomb, man. What are you doing chasing me? It's the TV He's static man. Human. He is the TV static man. That's the Get a life, bro. Time to pull the emergency stop. Oops. Oh, oh! What? Wow. You missed one beat and you're fucked. Don't Why does he start out wall, running? Man. Oh my gosh. Oh my 
making tentacles. <laughs> Oh, the leaves are falling. It's just like the falling. Oh, Tara. Are you hurt? I'm hurt, Tara. Oh. I think that was me, maybe. That is you, that's your shadow. Come on. Sway, little one. Ooh. Tara. Well, that's pretty. I'm still in a dream. Still yeah. Come in. Oh, I didn't see you there, Andrew. That's that's okay. I didn't see you there. There you go. Thank you. I and appreciate how's the chicken? Oh yeah, the chicken's good. It was, yeah, it was chicken delicious. Tara <laughs> said it. She was sucking her fingers, going, "This is chicken delicious." Did, did he leave? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Whoa. The big city. This is gonna be Terra. The big Snapple. Oh this God. motherfucker. Get a fucking life. Take pity on me, sir. Doing, doing. That's right. Wait, I recognize this place. Another long ass hallway. That's the door he was behind, right? That's right. Whoa. 
Wow. Wow. This is a cool place. The six six thing out of a Tim Burton movie. What? <laughs> More like MC Escher. I like the cathedral music. Well, it's like Cathedral Kitty. Okay. I gotta set the sensitivity on this camera down. It's like pinging me every five seconds. Jesus Christ. What's going on, house cam? No one was caught on camera. It's just a little windy tonight because the weather's all over the place. Guys, it's a little crazy right now. Wind's a little crazy. Camera is busy. Okay. Camera is busy. This really is MC Asher. What the? to follow the music. That's your theme, Tara. Mm Following the music, Tara. Yeah, it's kind of relaxing. This is like Scooby Doo. Oh! <laughs> Tricked you with that one, huh? I sure did. I think I know what I have to do. Oh, it's like the music box from when I found you. Whoa. Huh? Oh? 
my god. Wait, That's what? you! Is it? Yeah, with the raincoat. Trust me. Are you going to break the music box? Music box, Tara. I'm sorry. The only thing that brings me joy in this whole. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you just did a big ape slam. Broke my box. Now I'm gonna break you. Don't break me! Don't break me! I will bloody break you. You're all crooked and bent. Is this what happened to everybody? Guess so. I don't like it! Rip my fucking music box. Breaking Terra's iPod when it's playing Arctic Monkeys. 
The old Arctic monkeys, not the new shit. Let's be very clear on that. <laughs> That's why I don't know anything about Arctic monkeys besides what you've shown me. Ooh. Saw your sister in the cornerstone. Phone to the middleman. When I saw that she was on her own, I thought she might understand. She was close, but you couldn't get much closer. How am I supposed to get that? Don't touch me, Arctic monkeys. Crush me with your big hand. This looks like something we like created in Dolly. Does it? Oh! <laughs> Came back too soon. Man. Get the axe, man! Get the axe! You know, it looks like there's a lot of people on the left side, you know? What'd you say? See what I'm talking about? I said it looks like there's a ramp you can go up on the left side, like... Right here? Right there, yeah. Well... To, uh, slightly to the left of that, you see where it kind of goes up a little bit? Oh. You know, right there. Now's your chance, man! Run! Right oh. there! Oh. <laughs> Terry's gotta pee, folks. Oh, God. Go pee. Go piss. Good luck without me. I need you, help. but I need you. But I need you. <laughs> but I fucking need you.
Box is getting fucked up. I'm going to release you, Tara. I don't want to be the fucking monkey anymore. Tara, you have to let go. But the music is the only thing that's keeping let me grounded. Go. Oh, <laughs> fuck off. <man. laughs> fuck off. <laughs> what are you supposed to do, Jesus? I guess I need to wait longer. Or I need to go like... See what she does. Sorry about your music box. Oh, I'm back to normal. Hey, that was fucking weird, right? You were fucking huge. I know. That was a really unpleasant experience. We gotta get out of here! Ah! <laughs> The walls of your freaking bowels are closing in. What the hell is all this? Oh my god. I just got sucked into the poop dimension. To jump on top of the big, the big goop and poop. Boily, yeah. So go towards more. Oh! I'm literally following you to a T, and I'm getting killed. <laughs> Fucking hell! I'm sorry. I literally had to adjust my balls. And I almost died! Alright. Gamer rage needs to be turned down a little bit. I would just my balls! <laughs> Th this, this game's cinematic sequences would be so much cooler if there weren't a million stupid ways to die. Although it does make it funny. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, okay. There you go. Don't leave without me! 
Oh god. Dara! Don't what? leave without me! Grab my hand! Pull me up! No, not yet! No! <laughs> Why did I do that? Because you're a little nightmare! I can't go on without you. Or with you. So I have to go on by myself. Why did I do that? Cause you're a little fucking nightmare. I'm coming back for you, bitch. Wait, no. I, I I'm sure I had a good reason. Coming back for you, bitch. I control this fucking world. I'm sorry, what? So, you're the tall man? I'm becoming the TV man. And that's why I dissed you? I don't know. Maybe. Or maybe you're just a little nightmare. You are TV man! Ugh! Coming back for you, Tara. Oh, I've had enough. I've had enough. Ugh. I'm coming back for you, Tara.
Um, so I don't know, like, is there some sort of, like, time travel element to this as well? I don't think so. Kind of, maybe. Because... Were you chasing yourself, then? Yeah, to stop from being tricked by <laughs> the little bitch. But also, this was a prequel to Little Nightmares 1. I guess I just want to know exactly what it is that we just witnessed. <laughs> You got stuck in the TV world, you left me behind. And I became the TV man. How could there be? Oh, it's a CEO and CFO, CEO. Office dogs. special things. What is the look I'm giving? The thinking lips. <laughs> trying to figure out, like, were you the thing that was chasing yourself, or are there two? No, I think I was the thing that was chasing myself. How is that possible? I think the TV world has some f f fucky shit with it. Can we look up something online that, like, explanation, like, ending explain or something? We can do that. I just want to know, go. Wow, there's a lot of credits for this little game. <laughs> Jeez Louise. How does this little game have so many credits? They're kind of spaced out. something? Oh my god. It's up to you, girl. I'm going to pass out. Whoa! That's a lot of names! <laughs> it's still going. Folks, never make a game. If the team is this big, it's not worth it. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna pass out soon. Fuck. Girl. What? What the hey? Okay, alright, that's enough. Oh my 
surely it's gotta end soon, right, folks? Don't know. Don't know if it will. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, here we go. I don't know if it will. Oh, and the, that was even worth it. Well, thanks for joining Little Nightmares. We're gonna look up what the ending means real quick. Stand yeah. by. Yeah. Tara's curious. She's got her thinking lips on. Okay. Okay. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. So the main character's name is Mono. Okay. He goes to the tower to rescue Six, who has been warped by the tower. He succeeds in turning her back to normal, and the two attempt to escape the tower, which it reveals itself to be actually be a massive flesh monster covered in eyes, much like the symbol from the dark containing the Thin Man. A bridge erodes after Six makes it across, and Mono attempts to jump to safety, but he doesn't quite reach the ledge. Six grabs his hands and holds him for a moment before seemingly allowing him to drop into the depths. Players then see Mono grow as the, it, within the tower as the time passes, eventually becoming the Thin Man. Collecting all the 18 of the glitching remains unlocks a secret ending. Ooh, I guess we're going to watch the secret ending because I'm not doing that. Okay. Okay. Folks... Hold on. Okay. All right. Everybody's seen this part. So we've already seen this part.
we know it, we know it's that. Okay, now where's the secret part? Oh, here we go. She's hungry. What does that mean? Well, I guess you'll just have to find out. In Little Nightmares 1. Hmm. Yeah. What the ending of Little Nightmare 2 means for Mono. Seeing Mono as he grows within the tower and eventually comes with the men suggests that Mono's part in the story is almost paradoxical. Mono is ejected from the television with the power to pass through portals and bend reality. He releases the Thin Man from his prison. He kills the Thin Man. Six drops him into the tower and Mono becomes the Thin Man. The cycle repeats. Ironically, the revelation of his true identity may have been the reason Six dropped him in the first place. It's impossible to know for sure, but one popular theory expressed by blah 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 is that Six saw Mono's face and realized he'll be the Thin Man. Remember that this was the first time seeing him without the paper bag over his head. If this is true, her fear of the Thin Man may have led her to inadvertently create him. This also suggests that Mono could be the source of the tower's power. His ability to alter reality may very well be the battery in which the tower uses to order the broadcast signal and warp the world around it. Six's story went in a different direction after dropping Mono. Her ending reveals that Little Nightmares 2 is not is most likely not a sequel at all. It is actually a prequel. This is why Six didn't have a raincoat at the beginning of the game. No mm -hmm. more no more reading at that point. That's a spoiler. Is it? I don't want you to know nothing about Little Nightmares 1, just in case I ever play it. Well, I know that the main girl in Little Nightmares 1 is wearing a raincoat. Mm hmm. <laughs> well, that was Little Nightmares 2, folks. We cleared it. Yeah. Tara was spooked. She was kidnapped. She's back, and she's hungrier than ever. Oh, boy. That's really in character. Like, you come out of the TV, and your stomach's growling. And rumbling. You're going... Oh. <laughs> but I'm, like, never hungry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, Tara, any last words before you end the stream? Nope. <laughs> I have one thing to say. Mm-hmm.
What a little nightmare. That was like... Like a little nightmare. <laughs> Playing through that game. <laughs> Alright. Bye, everybody. Bye. Terry just poofed me with a cloud of <laughs> fucking vape. <laughs> Bye. Poof. <laughs>